head of the presidential primary of the All Progressive Congress APC, two of the leading aspirants have begun to plot victory graph on how to secure the tickets of the party. Sunday Tribune investigation revealed that a former governor of Lagos State and national leader of the party, Senator Bola Tinumbu and the Minister of Transportation, Rotibi Amechi, are pushing ahead of other aspirants by fishing for the votes of the party's statutory delegates. Both Tinumbu and Amechi's jostling for delegates is part of their backup plans should the rumored consensus arrangements being flown by some interests within the party fail. It was gathered that the statutory delegates of the party number about 3,000 across the 36 states and the Federal Capital Territory, FCT. The statutory delegates are former and serving federal lawmakers as well as former current principal officers of state assemblies. Sunday Tribune investigations reveal that they constitute about one-third of the total delegates who will decide the fate of the presidential aspirants, Amici's full soldiers. Sunday Tribune gathered exclusively have met statutory delegates from the Southwest twice within a month. The meetings which were held during the week of the party's national convention last month and on April 5th took place in Ibadan, the Oyo state capital. The executive secretary of the Nigerian Ship House Council and 2019 APC gubernatorial candidate in Benue state, Emmanuel Le Yambe Jimmy, led Amechi's representatives to the second meeting attended by about 100 of the delegates. It was gathered that Emmanuel Leambe marketed the reasons the delegates should give their vote to the two-term River State Governor, chief of which was his legislative experience as a former speaker. The delegates who came from all six Southwest states were told that they would have unhindered access to Amechi if he becomes the president. A source privy to one of the meetings told Sunday Tribune that the delegates only listened to them and never made any commitments as to who we get their votes. It was learned that Tinubu also met with about 500 of the statutory delegates at a hotel in Abuja on the eve of the party's national convention last month. At the meeting, Tinubu, it was gathered, told the attendees why he should be allowed to govern the country, noting that he had paid his democratic dues. During the meeting, he told us how we will, he will approach the issue of insecurity and economy, said one of the delegates. A former head of the Economic and Financial Crime Commission, EFCC, Nu Ribadu, and Ekiti Central Senator, Okpoyemi Bamidele, were some of those who accompanied Tinubu to the meeting. Ribadu, who also spoke at the meeting, described Tinubu as the most qualified to land the job and charged the delegates to give him their votes. The former EFCC chief was quoted to the to have said that speculations about corruption allegations against Tinubu could not be substantiated. <laughs> he told the delegates that as the EFCC under him investigated Tinubu a number of times and found nothing incriminating against him. Before the Abuja meeting, about 200 of the statutory delegates from the Southwest delegates had gathered at a hotel in Ibadan where they declared their support for Tinumbu. The group of Southwest delegates is being coordinated by a former deputy governor of Ogun State and former senator from Ogun East, Senator Gbenga Kaka, and a former Lagos West Senator, Ganiyu Solomon. Meanwhile, as part of his ongoing consultations, Amechi is expected to visit the Alafi of Foyo, Obalamidi, Adeyemi, the Olubadon of Ibadan land. Obalekon, Balogun, and other leaders of thoughts in Oyo State. Hmm, tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is the time for them to chop, 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 chop. Collect from this one, collect from that one. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, <laughs> they will vote for another person. That is their lives. And that is why a lot of people are into politics. Some people don't even know what to do after politics. Outside politics, they can do nothing. You see how they are trying to as mad themselves. This statement that Tinubu is always making, eh, as if he's the creator of this country. I don't understand. He has paid his democratic, 
uh, deals. He has paid his deals. He has this and that. So who now? Who, who you help? Who you? Ah, ah. They didn't help the nation. I don't even understand. He has paid his deals. That is no cup of tea. But let's see how all of them, all of this thing will play out. All of them running tika 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 tika. Oshiba Yotu will still be running. They will see this, uh, this delegate also. The all of them will say yes, yes, yes. This one will come. They say yes, yes, yes. Then that one will come. They say yes, yes, yes. You are the one. We support you. <laughs> oh my goodness. Something must drop. <laughs> Something must drop. Amechi is very rude to have been thinking of contesting election against Jagawa. Who? Okay, because Sinobu is his father. Be. Sometimes you guys talk without thinking. What has been rude? Being rude got to do with uh, him regarding Jagaban. Make Una try reason and get sense for once. Amechi should not be deceived by Southwest delegates. No Yoruba delegates will vote for him. They are very tribalistic. Uh, so Tinubu know how to approach the security problems that is facing this country, but kept, kept it until he becomes the president. Hell, the whole country may be wiped off before then, sir. This man has full access to this buhari led government but he wants to be the president before he will help the country can you see <laughs> and who told you he wants to help nigeria he's not ready to help nigeria that's it so he was the man who advised buhari saying dollar will be equal to one naira petrol will be 15 naira per liter today where are we now he's indirectly telling the youth that buhari kept on complaining about the past instead of fixing the country all in the name of votes B Nigeria, okay, shall die a natural death if Tinubu rule, rule us. Amechi is no match for Jagaban structure wise. Structure wise or political experience, Jagaba has seen it all, even in the time of Nadeku. Where is Amechi then? We can see his agbero structure, but that is not a problem. They will be taken care of as soon as Amechi becomes the president. <laughs> All these guys, eh? All these people, eh? Hmm. Uh, this is a national politics, not West agenda. Outside Southwest, where do you think your so-called Jagaban can will a delegate votes? Please don't even let tickets of the party be given to Agbiru. Uh, the two looters are Nigeria's enemies. Nigerians should be aware of Tinubu's. It is better for devil to rule than Tinubu's. Nigerians should be aware of a man that will make you hungry, deprive you of the tools to catch fish and cultivate the soul and give you a plate of food just to control you. That's it. I meet you all the way. This made me laugh. Are we not even looking for messiahs? The two are absolutely reliable and can be trusted. How I wish one of them can be my president <laughs> and your family. Uh, a kingmaker can never be a king. Check the history of kingmakers and tell me just one that was made a king. It is true. IBB made Obasanjo. Did he become president? No. It is God who enthroned in Kingo. <laughs> the race is never to the swift. Didn't we should go and rest? Even Amechi both have nothing good to offer Nigeria. In fact, that's it. Fa, 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 fa. Two of them. Fa, 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 fa. 